And yeah, he's perfect. He's literally perfect. Nothing, nothing to do with him. He's perfect. We're still together. We're still fine. So no, nothing to do with him. driving crazy because everyone's being so nice about it. Dude, it drives me crazy because people are like, you're gonna be fine, like, whatever, like, it's a short lived time in your life. I'm like, this is something you will never have to deal with. So, don't tell me how I'm supposed to be feeling. They're like, stop crying, like, you're gonna be fine. I'm like, but it's not you. It's not you. Now, if it were you, oh, silenced silenced no oh, it's not even about the program thing it's about the way that my life's gonna be for the next few months is just I don't even want to talk about it I don't even want to talk about it Alright, that's done. My shirt on backwards. Anyways, let's touch up my makeup really quick and then I'm gonna get off of here because I got pe people to see. I might send a cowboy hat. Oh my god. Do you remember that era where everyone would send cowboy hats to me? Oh my goodness. Unlocked a memory. That's been a while. Thank you for the gifts that if you guys are sending them. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um. Wait, did you go back to blonde? Doesn't my hair look lighter? My hair looks like so bad right now, but it's fine. I, like, tried to touch it up, but it's not working. Doesn't it look like it's lighter? What the heck? Like, I got it dyed back to my natural, and then I feel like it lightened. Is that dandruff? Like, what am I... Is there something in my hair? Oh, Anyways. Let's do a little bit of makeup really quick so that I don't look. Yeah, it looks dark. It looked darker when it. Ugh. It looked darker when I first got it done, but I feel like since I've been washing it, like the toner and so it's like coming out or something. And my blonde's coming back out. Am I tripping? Maybe. Did I take my sugar bear hair today? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I so panicked. Because all my hair was falling out, and now my hair is so thin, because I got it bleached so much, and yeah, that's that. My hair is just not it. But it's fine. We're going to get it back to where we want it eventually. Oh, and another one. <laughs> and another one. It's fine. Let's do my a little tiny bit of makeup. I haven't put on any lash serum today. I yeah. Yeah. I haven't been going anywhere. Oh, and you want to know to make my life worse? You guys don't even know what I'm dealing with. <laughs> oh. But to make it worse, I lost my car keys. No, this has nothing to do with man. My man is perfect. Perfect. Is my chest like red? I'm like itching. I lost my car keys. And my spare is 
back in Palm Desert. Thanks for that hat. So, and before I call my dad to let him know that I lost him, because listen, I drove back here from home. I was home this weekend, and I'm going back home this weekend because I'm dealing with some stuff. And I drove back here Sunday night, and I haven't left the dorms since. But today, like, our campus is so big, I was going to drive to, like, where the theater building is, which is still on campus. Like, I wasn't leaving campus or anything. And, um, because I needed to go get, like, some things, um, a slip or something. And I could not find my keys anywhere. Anywhere. So I searched for, like, an hour, could not find them. I was like, okay, I'll just come back. Like, I'll chill out because I was getting really angry. Like, I was so frustrated because... Of course, when my life goes bad, it just, so much things, like, has, has to get worse, whatever. Searched everywhere, came back, searched everywhere for, like, an hour, another hour, nowhere. Searched my hamper, searched my backpack. All I did when I went home this weekend was bring my backpack and water bottle. Not anywhere in there, not in my car. My car won't lock if my keys are left in my car. My car's locking, so, because I can do it off of my phone, and it's locking, so. Um, it's not in my car. Um, it's not in my hamper, it's not in my backpack. I literally checked my freaking trash can because I was scared that it fell off my desk. It's I usually put it up here on my desk, not here, not in my purse, not anywhere. I looked under my bed, like if it fell off my bed, and all of my drawers. I literally looked at my drawers, like, maybe, like, I opened a drawer and my key fell off my bed. Into, like, I was thinking of all the possibilities. <coughs> and then, before I even... I might tell the cowboy head again, please. Then, before I even call my dad, because I didn't want to call my dad and bother him if I, like, found it or something, or, like, if it wasn't that much to get a replacement. So I called. I was like, how much would it be to replace a car key? Like, if you guys came out here and, like, gave me a new key fob, whatever. $500. Listen, I got school to pay for. I got car insurance to pay for, a phone bill, like, buddy, no, that, no, I'm not dropping, no, (laughs) so I called my dad, and he was like, well, keep looking, and if you can't find it, then I'll drive up and bring you your spare, I don't want to make that man drive up and bring me a spare key, like, that drive is two and a half hours for a key. Dad, I'm so sorry. But I haven't... I'm going to look again tomorrow. And if I still can't find it by tomorrow, well... I'm like, Dad, just over, overnight ship it to me. That's where my head goes. But he, when I called him, he was like, no, I'll just drive it to you. But, like, that's so, so, I'm sorry, Dad. I'm so sorry. And I have to drive home this weekend. So, like, maybe you left them in someone's car. No, guys, I haven't left campus at all. So there's no way. I haven't been in, like, I haven't brought them in anyone's car. I haven't. I also called all of the lost and founds at my school. It's just, just not okay. Cowboy hits are calling my name. Yeah, your name, not mine. <laughs> Liam. Um, my eyelash serum is like all out, and I'm not gonna be spending money on a new one because I'm not gonna be spending any money. I'm saving mode. No money, no, no money on food, clothes, nothing. Straight school and necessities which like that I like obviously need to buy 
And, yep, that's about it. Alright guys, I'm going to get off because my friends are probably waiting for me to go eat dinner or something. I'm so hungry. It's not a joke. Alright. Mm. Oh my god, I forgot I took all my rings off earlier. No, no, no. Is it in Diego's room? No, I haven't even been to Diego's since I've been back. So, <gasps> no. I lost him and I don't know where. So, yay me. <laughs> I checked all my jackets. I checked my hamper. Like, went through all of my clothes. Went through my pants, jeans. Went through the clothes that were in my drawer. Went through my trash can. Went through my desk completely. Went through all of these drawers, which I don't even open those drawers, so why would it be in there? I don't know. Went in my purse, went in my car, went on my bed, went through my sheets, went underneath my bed, like, everywhere. Looked underneath the refrigerator, looked underneath my closet, like. So, yeah, I came back on Sunday, came straight to my room, and went and never left my room. So, <laughs> My dad was like, make sure that your car isn't moving. I was like, what? What do you mean moving? He was like, well, you never know if someone has your keys and, like, driving it around. Oh, yeah, the yeah, dad thinks. EDC. Um... Bye, you guys. With the life I've been living, I'm not. But, yeah. I'm going through some a rough patch of my life. But it's okay. Starts bawling. It's okay. Everything will be fine. <laughs> Goodbye.